Hi, I'm Tim Wright. I'm pastor at Community of Grace in Peoria, Arizona, which is a suburb of Phoenix. And for those of you men who are watching today, I want to ask you a question. When you were a junior high boy, did you ever have a man walk up to you and look you in the eye and ask you this strategic question? What kind of a man do you want to be? Well, as a pastor, I was doing a lot of thinking about that over the last few years, wondering how we as a church could help our boys begin to wrestle with those kinds of questions and provide a safe environment where they could begin to discover for themselves what it means to be the man God created them to be. And in my reading and research, I came across an author, Michael Gurian, who's written several best-selling books, uh, prominent among them, The Wonder of Boys. And Michael and his organization, the Gurian Institute, have been working with teachers and educators and schools and school systems to help them do a better job of educating our boys and our girls. And so I sent Michael an email, and he graciously responded back. And in the process, we developed a friendship. And out of that friendship and a lot of the hours of conversation, we created an experience for boys that helps them answer that question, what kind of a man do you want to be? And we call it Following Jesus, A Heroic Quest for Boys. And as we were designing this particular experience, we had a lot of tools available to us that generations of people have used in order to help boys discover the kind of men they want to be. The first of those tools are all of the great heroic quest stories that we have that have come to us throughout the ages. The second tool that we had available to us is one that our culture doesn't use very often anymore, and that's a rite of passage. And Michael comes from a Jewish background where rites of passage are still very, very important. And Michael, talk a little bit about what a rite of passage is and why it's so important, particularly for our young boys. Yeah, a rite of passage is a series of challenges that force, uh, in, a, in a safe way, in a challenging way, that force the boy, and these are true for girls as well, but for boys there's urgency because they don't grow up in the same way girls do. So they've, throughout history, put themselves in front of challenges and been led in front of challenges and with challenges to grow up. So it's really a maturation process. In the Jewish tradition, you know, a bar mitzvah, which also can be a bat mitzvah, but started out as a bar mitzvah for boys, and they were put through a number of challenges. And in the old days, obviously, it was Hebrew and learning, and, and um, it was intellectual. Uh, and then in the heroic quests, it's more physical. So movies, fairy tales, more physical. Every church, no matter how small or large it is, has a wealth of wisdom in every man that is in that congregation. And then the final tool we have is the most important, and that's Jesus, who through two very powerful words calls boys into manhood when he says, follow me. The program is made up of several different components. There are some large group experiences where the boys and their mentors come together, and in an interactive way, we talk about the various character qualities of heroic following and heroic manhood. Then the boys get together with their mentors, and in their small groups, they talk about questions that we've designed that help the boys and the men really wrestle with, what does it look like for me to follow Jesus as I grow into manhood? We provide a retreat for the boys near the end of the experience, which is probably the most important part of the whole experience, where the boys and their mentors really get at the heart of what it means to be a man. The boys participate along with their mentors in a serve day, and then we have several tasks for them to do throughout the experience uh, to help them grow in their faith, help them wrestle with issues of manhood that will prepare them for the journey that's ahead of them as they begin to grow up. And we want to invite you to join us in rewriting the storyline of our boys, giving them purpose, and calling them to follow Jesus into heroic manhood.